So every morning, I usually wake up first because I let Cindy sleep in. But today she was so excited about making this video that she decided to wake up first and she also decided to wake me up in the most gentle and soft way possible, which you would think would be some kind of kiss or embrace, but instead she uses a pillow that I bought her for her birthday and smacks me in the face like three or four times. So that was fantastic. We're putting it to good use. <laughs> We're putting it to good use. At least it's a way to wake up. It's a nice soft alarm, and it's made of cotton, so it wasn't that uh, abrasive. Pinch and then, your nipple. <laughs> to make sure I was completely awake, she decided to pinch my nipple, and I had to fight her off like a freaking wild animal. But she did give me some kisses, so it kind of made up for all the pain and abuse that I had to go through just to wake up. Now, Cindy's deciding if she wants to uh, get in on my reading time, which I hold very near and dear because it's a way to get rid of any kind of excess uh, weight I might have. She didn't want me to read to her, so she left. Now, I always make fresh coffee in the morning, and I roast my own beans uh, in that little roaster you see in the corner there. And then I weigh them out, and I grind them because there is actually kind of a science to making coffee. Science! Believe it or not. You're supposed to do a certain amount of beans to a certain amount of water, or otherwise it tastes really weird. So, I'm grinding my own beans. I'm weighing them out and make sure it's perfect, and then I grind the living crap out of them. Let also, grind on me. I like that song. <laughs> Relax your body, take your time on me. She's, she likes that song. Ride right with me, baby. Between our voices. You like that? Anyway, so I'm grinding the crap out of the coffee. There's usually a little bit left in there, so I choke the crap out of it. Sometimes you have to choke it a little bit because that's just how you get more more things out of it. It ends up working better. And then the other thing you got to do is, especially with a special grinder or a fresh grinder, you have to kind of brush all the grinds out. Make sure you get all of it. Otherwise, what's the point? I don't know what she's doing here. I think I didn't even realize she left me, actually, at this point. I was so concentrating on getting all the beans out. Oh, I remember this now. It was like a sneak attack. She decided to sneak attack me with the pillow. That's apparently our, our violence pillow now. We're going to put a big V on the back. So anyway, I get all the grinds out of my grinder. I'll put a V on your back. You're going to put a V on my back? I hope that's not the only place you put a V. So we get all the grinds out of there. I love my coffee too. And Cindy can't have any. It's too much caffeine for her. So I get to have usually a whole pot to myself, which is where all of my energy comes from. If you guys watch my videos for my gaming, that's really me. And it's usually because of this entire pot of coffee that I'm about to imbibe on. So uh, we have a whole bunch of different coffee uh, cups to be using. I usually use, you guys see all my coffee cups in my videos. I have Starbucks. I have Marvel cups. I have a couple. Cindy doesn't decide she doesn't like this cup for Too today. Boring. So she pulls down my spawn cup. Yay. No, that's Venom. My Venom cup. Oh, I want to get I want to get the Carnage cup, which we didn't get in my loot crate. I wasn't lucky enough to get the, the Carnage one. But she's going to probably end up stealing my cup. We're checking my nose to make sure I don't have to blow it, which I'm good. So that's pretty... No pretty, bats in the cave. No bats in my belfry. And then we got to grab some more things now. Now, every morning, I'd say 99% of the time, I make the same breakfast, just with kind of different ingredients. I make like a breakfast sandwich. Using the pan as like a weapon with silver Rapunzel of you. Oh, I was worried that you were going to attack me with something else. I was defending myself. I was going on the, on the offense for <laughs> once. So I defended myself with that pan just in case. And I always do a bagel. I make my coffee first. That way it's done by the time I'm making my breakfast. A good way to get bagels open if they're not working. If you look here, I'm kind of pinching it and then twisting. That works every time. It also works on English muffins and everything. So that's a little trick for me to you in case you like bagels. Also turn the damn bagel thing on. That's why it's on the, uh, on the, the what's the damn thing called? The toaster. That we only toast one side of it. That was pretty, that was pretty impressive, right? Toaster. Toaster. Brave little toaster. I love the brave little toaster. That vacuum gets overlooked all the time. Anyway, so make sure you spray the pan with some pan spray because that's why they call it pan spray. And then do a little happy face just for your girlfriend because she makes me smile every day. Now, I usually do between three to five eggs just because I need my proteins, but then a thunderstorm strikes and I'm totally paranoid because I'm about to have a freaking aneurysm because she's going to give me some kind of like dance party and I wasn't ready for her. And then I, I give the, they got to give the oven a little bit of love just because you never, you never know. <laughs> the oven doesn't get a lot of love. It puts heat out, but it never gets any heat put in. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, I did three eggs <gasps> this morning because I didn't want a lot of eggs. And then I, I gave the, the sink was wet for me already. So I had to show it some love. And then uh, we move over and get all the rest of my ingredients. Now I usually do vegetables, some kind of meat, and then cheese. Today's cheese, I think was Colby Jack. I love Colby Jack and I like uh, Pepper Jack. Uh, and sometimes I'll do Swiss and sometimes I do provolone. But lately I've been stuck on the Colby Jack cheese. It's one of my favorites. See, they're showing it to you. Just so you guys know. It's my favorite flavor. You don't have a favorite? Flavorite. Yeah, I have favorite yeah, songs and favorite cheese, foods. Non dairy. No, yeah, I know. We're going to need to get some non dairy cheese. And then today I decided to do some avocado, aguacate, if you're Spanish, and some tomato, tomate, I think, if you're Spanish. I don't speak French. Uh, and I cut it up with this awesome knife that I got as a gift. Now, the thing with avocado, like I was telling Cindy too, is you got to make sure it's just right. Uh, usually when avocado is ripe, it almost looks like it's not because <laughs> it's got to be soft. So it starts to sometimes get a little bit of brown spots, but it's still delicious, nutritious, and fantastic. So I slice it up pretty, pretty good uh, just so it goes on my sandwich a little bit better. Because, what the hell? Did you hit me there? Were you trying to be violent again? 
Sydney's violent in the most. Were you being violent? You trying to punch me? Oh, I think I was trying to scare you because I didn't want you to. Yeah, but then I was gonna cut my thumb off. Yeah. That's why you stopped. Okay. All right. So eggs are about halfway done at this point. So usually, at like I always cook everything at like medium, just because then I have time to do all the extra crap. And then I cut tomato. I love tomatoes, and Cindy hates them. So you eat the crap out of some uh, some ketchup. That's different. I know, well, it's different texture, but like, they're, it's ketchup is made of tomatoes. I don't and know what, it has something else on it. Yeah, it has like salt and sugar. Yeah, duh, hello. Well, what if we put different. salt and sugar on tomatoes? Would you eat a salt and sugar tomato sandwich? No. We're gonna do that experiment someday. That's gonna be a video. No. We're gonna see if she knows the difference. No. <laughs> so, always put your ingredients back in the fridge because you know what? That's how crap goes bad. And then on my eggs, I always put fresh ground. Uh, that's Himalayan pink sea salt, which is awesome. Fresh ground black pepper. I don't remember where that's from. I'm gonna say Blackland. Uh, fresh ground pirate's bite, which pirate's bites from it's a it's a store called Tea and Spice Exchange. It's awesome. And then I use fresh organic garlic uh, from Simply Balanced from Target. Uh, if you get a chance to go to Tea and Spice. Tarjay, if you're gonna be nasty, um, bougie or bougie, am I am I bougie, baby? No, you're a penny pincher. I'm a penny pinching, yeah, but I do like to. And right there is, I she's being bad. She's a bad girl. I'm a bad boy. She's a bad girl. <laughs> so I had to show her what the spatula's for. That's what the little holes are for. I tell you what, my grandmother used to have a paddle. She used to hit me with that was like, well, not just me, like all the kids. And she wouldn't hit us hard. She would just kind of like be like, bad, yeah, and she'd hit you. So anyway, I flipped my eggs. I didn't break a single one of them because I'm a professional cook. I grab my bagel, I throw in some cheese, throw in all the veggie tables. That's how you say it. Veggie tables. Don't argue with me. She's blinking really rapidly. She wants to correct me so bad. It's hilarious right now. So you put all the vegetables on there, uh, get everything together and ready. And then I usually put another piece of cheese on top uh, just because it, it kind of melts when you put the egg on there. It keeps all your crap together so all your stuff doesn't go falling out. And I'm kind of a weirdo neat freak, so I had to clean my plate up. What? I didn't even see you do that. Yeah, I didn't want all the crap on the plate. Yeah, I know. But, you know, it makes it look pretty. Presentation is all half of eating, right? Got to use all your senses. You're like an Instagram basic bitch. Um, I don't even use Instagram, though. I mean, I do. I'm trying to use but Instagram. You do. I mean, I do. You're trying to get me to use it. All right, here you go. Look at this. So the eggs go on top. I put one on the side. Put that crap together. Look how beautiful that is. Splendiferous. Fantabulistic. And then, the perfect thing is, see that? What I was telling you? My coffee's done. Look at that. Timing is awesome. That's why you start the coffee first. Never start the coffee last because you're eating your food or waiting for your coffee and both things suck. You don't want to just have no damn coffee. So my coffee, I usually do a scoop and a half of sugar. I have hypoglycemia, so I have to have sugar throughout the day and I don't really like candy that much. Or if I do like candy, I like it way too freaking much and I eat all of it. Are you staring at my butt again? There's all there's like six butt shots in every one of my videos because Cindy just, I do squats. I like to do a lot of lunges. So I use, um, what's the cream I'm using? It's, it's like pepper nipple Girl or Scouts, it's a girl. like a pedo. <laughs> Stop taking butt pictures of me. Anyway, so I do a little bit of two different creamers just for a little bit of flavor. A lot of times I like my coffee black, but I can't do it right now because I need my sugar. Grab my bagel. Grab me a fork. Cindy's got her coffee. It's Diet Dr. Pepper because she can't drink coffee. So she's drinking that her healthy, healthy, healthy coffee soda. And uh, we're having ourselves a good little, little time. So as I sit down, I realize Cindy didn't have food. So I tell her, go, hurry. Get out of here. Go get your food. So she decides to get her revenge by tossing the pillow at me again. And she's coming back and getting her breakfast. And what do you got there? Beaches and hummus. Yeah, it's so breakfast. good. Yeah, so I eat my breakfast. I'm munching down like a madman because it is so delicious and nutritious. Meanwhile, she's eating her crap. How many you ate that whole damn bag, didn't you? No, don't judge me. <laughs> but after breakfast, you always got to clean up and do all your dishes and get everything done. So that was our. That's pretty much exactly what our morning goes like every day. We end up flirting and playing more than we end up cooking and doing anything else. That's why. That's why we have the bestest relationship of all time. Be jealous, guys. So that's our breakfast uh, routine. Pretty much every day. We might, do it a, we might do a different one if we switched up for you. But until next time, this is Leldrin and Clell signing off. Be sure to join us every single day. Same Leldrin time, same Leldrin channel, and every Monday, Wednesday, Friday for my gaming live stream. But until then, get out of here, guys. <laughs> I got some cleaning to do.